now, here's meteorologist Michelle Muscatello with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, another beautiful summer-like evening to fire up the grill as we wrap up what is a holiday weekend for a lot of folks here with Columbus Day. Let's go ahead and start it off by taking a look at temperatures. And we are running well above average. Typical for October 10th is a temperature of a high 65 degrees. Well, we are running 13 degrees above that here in Woonsocket, 77 in Cranston, 75 right now in Tiverton, Little Compton's at 78, Cushnitz in the upper 70s, and even westerly right now at a warm 79 degrees, and it's happening under bright blue skies. Uh, we continue with the dry air, live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar has been able to take that holiday weekend as well as we've remained storm-free all weekend, and it's all courtesy of this area of high pressure that's still sitting firmly in control over the northeast. Now, in the coming days, we've got a cold front that'll come through tonight. Not much fanfare with the front, only a few high clouds and a shift in the wind, no rain with it, but it will bring in a new air mass for us and a cooler air mass. And then we have to look far to our south. We saw some of that video of flooding in Florida. Well, it's all this storm system here that's bringing some much needed rain to parts of the southeast. Well, this low pressure center will work its way up the east coast and give us the risk for off and on showers starting on Wednesday. And it may take until the end of the work week for that to completely, at least the shower threat, to completely clear out. For this afternoon, we've got temperatures around 81 here at 1 o'clock, 3 o'clock in the afternoon, 83, and then at 5 in the evening, 79. And just like what we've seen happen last couple of nights, the temperatures will fall quickly after sunset. And it's another comfortable night for sleeping. But about 82 in Central Falls this afternoon, 83 downtown, the east side at 83 on the East Bay. Beautiful day to take a bike ride. 82 in Barrington. Garden City at 83, TF Green Airport in the lower 80s. And even the coast, because of a northwest wind, that land breeze, we're in the upper 70s to around 80 at the beaches, 82 in Wickford, 83 in Coventry. Low humidity and sunshine, the Situate Art Festival wrapping up today. A beautiful day for that. Similar uh, conditions up in Winsonka at the Autumn Fest. Johnston's at about 83. And we're going to keep the sunshine this afternoon in New Bedford and Fall River, low 80s, Middletown, right around 80 degrees. On the bay, sunshine and uh, no problems visibility wise. Winds are light, waves at one foot or less. The high tides at 7 18 in the morning, low tide at uh, just coming up here about 1 o'clock in the afternoon. The beaches, we saw how busy it was down in Narragansett Beach, and we've got an air temperature today of about 78 degrees at the shore. The water temperature is still running in the middle 60s, and the safe sun time without any sunscreen before you'd see any burning would be about 25 minutes for today. For the evening and nighttime hours, again, temperatures do cool off. So we hit our high of 83. By 8 o'clock in the evening, we're back down to 70. By midnight, 61. And then late tonight, temperatures should fall into the mid and upper 50s. We may see some spots drop off into the upper 40s to lower 50s. And we'll just see some high clouds, but should be able to see those moonlit skies. We've got the uh, full harvest moon these next couple of days, or hunter's moon also can be called in October. Your seven-day future cast for you. So we do see a cool down. It starts to Tomorrow, temperatures hit a high of about 70 degrees in the afternoon, still under mainly sunny skies. And then even cooler for Wednesday, increasing clouds, the threat of a few showers mainly later in the day. We'll have to dodge some showers on Thursday, and it should wrap up through the first half of the day on Friday. The weekend right now for next weekend, looking certainly more like the season. Uh, mostly sunny, cool, and dry. Highs in the 60s, nighttime lows in the 40s and 50s.